Hey folks, welcome back to Ed's Garage at Merton Hyundai. Today, just a quick video on um, a response to a, um, a comment on one of my videos recently in regards to regenerative braking versus using the brake pedal, which also is regenerative braking. Uh, so the comment was that when you use your brakes, uh, you're only getting about 50% of the regenerative uh, ability uh, of the braking and then it's brake pedals. So that isn't the case. It actually does use 100% regenerative braking. As a matter of fact, you can access more regenerative braking by hitting the brake pedal than you would with the paddles on the Hyundai Kona or the Hyundai Ioniq. Um, obviously, the, using the paddles slows you down very quickly, but not as quickly as the brake pedal could. Uh, so when you're slowing down very quickly with the paddles, you'll see if you're looking at the EV uh, consumption screen, it'll actually show you in negative numbers the kilowatts. So on the following video uh, that you're about to see, I did a quick test with my own vehicle. It's a 2017 Hyundai Ioniq. Uh, the system hasn't changed really that much. The new Kona does have the ability to come to a complete stop when holding on well, the new Ioniq as well. When holding down the left paddle, um, <clears throat> However, it, it's, it's only slightly, uh, you know, harder braking, uh, harder regenerative braking than when you're just slowing down when you're letting off the accelerator. Uh, however, when you press the brake pedal, it gets to the same level and then continues to increase in the amount of regenerative braking, which you'll see uh, on the video. So check it out. All right, I'm going to jump up to about 100 kilometers an hour and then let off the accelerator. I'm in currently level three regeneration. Uh, so I'm going to jump up to 100, hang out there for a second, and then let go of the accelerator. And we got up to 60 kilowatts there. All right, I'm going to get up to 100. One more time. And there. About 60 kilowatts again. So that's not using the brake pedal, that's just all regenerative braking. So I'll try it one more time. 200. Let go. 61. Okay, so that's all with regenerative braking. Now we're going to try it with just using the regular braking. So I'm going to turn off regeneration completely. Got a couple of corners to go around here. So you can see on the bottom right here, the regeneration is completely turned off. All right, and I'm just gonna get around a corner here and then we'll speed up again. All right, slow down a bit, get some distance between us and the car in front of us. All right, so jump back up to 100. It's going to be a little easier to coast at 100 now. There we go. So coasting, 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 and braking. 86 kilowatts. <laughs> okay, well, I think that's pretty definitive. All right, so you can get more regeneration by just hitting the brakes. I mean, obviously, you're slowing down a bit faster. So if I slow down roughly the same amount as the regen, uh, it's hard to modulate. I honestly don't know how much I'm slowing down in comparison to the regen. It's, it's really hard to modulate. Um, but as you can see, we're getting way up into there, into the neg negative 80 kilowatts. All right, so pretty clear, yeah, when you're, when you're pressing the brake pedal, you really do get to access full 100% regenerative braking. As a matter of fact, you can see it on the instrument cluster as well on the left side of your instrument cluster screen where it shows whether you're using power or charging. Um, you'll notice that when you let off the accelerator and even when pulling that left paddle, uh, the charging level never really gets to the full 100%. However, when you hit the brakes, it goes right up to full 100%. And then if you press even harder on the brakes, that's when you start to access the brake pads, uh, the friction braking system. So I hope this video helped you out. I hope this uh, helped to answer some questions. If you enjoyed this quick little video, please don't forget to hit like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Take care.